Hey, are you recording right now? Uh, how, uh, how can you tell? Oh, uh, you just push this button right... Hey, um, I think it's on. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. Oh, sh- oh, fuck! God damn it. What? What, 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 what? The camera's broken. What do you, what do you mean it's broken? It's, the video's not turning up, it's completely black. It's completely- It's because you had the lens cap on, you fucking <laughs> torque. Uh, ah. Uh, yeah. All right, Peter, could you please uh, tell us how you know this guy? Um, Kyle? Yeah. So, we actually met in high school, so we're sort of childhood friends in that sense. Um, I've known him forever, but we don't really we don't really talk too much these days. We don't really keep in contact, you know what I mean? Why is that? Um, I don't know. He was always like uh, like the conspiracy theorist type, you know? So when we were little, he was always claiming that he got footage of the Loch Ness Monster on his dad's GoPro, or that he was abducted by aliens, like actually. No, you gotta, this isn't plugged in back here. Okay. I don't know, it's kind of cute and fun for a little bit, but after a while it just kind of got to be like, too much, you know what I mean? But when I found out that we had to interview someone for our film production one class, I figured why not just call up Kyle and uh, arrange an interview with him. Oh, oh shit, okay. This is Kyle right now. Um, sh 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 okay, bye. Uh, hey buddy, um, how you doing? Uh, we're about seven minutes away. Uh, we should be there soon, all right? Okay, sweet. Um uh, did you get like the map and everything that I sent you? Yeah, I got the um, I got the map you sent us along with the uh, instructions for what to do when we get there and all that. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, look, I'm I'm sorry to make you go through all that. You know, you can't be too careful with email and all that stuff. You know. Yeah. It, it, yeah. If you want, you can just text me if, if that's easier. Wait, I can text you. I thought I thought that you didn't trust uh, digital communication and all that, and that's why we had to communicate via letters. Oh well, you can just text me now if you want. Uh, okay. Do you do you have a smartphone? No. Why? How am I talking to you right now? Satellite phone. Okay, um, well, we should be there soon, uh, so yeah, uh, I'll see you soon, man. Alright, see you soon, man. Alright, bye. <laughs> Alright, looks like we are here. Wow, here's a, here's a nice house. Okay. Alright, the, uh, the instructions say that, uh, upon arrival, knock on the garage door on a three-on-two beat pattern. What the hell does that even mean? A three on two beat pattern. A three over two polyrhythm. Three yes, over. Sir, with a, the okay. Two beat, and I'm just gonna kill it very slowly. Oh! Ah! There we go! Oh, uh. Oh, Kyle, are you in there? Hey! 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 Oh, how you doing? Nice. Good, how are you? Hey! Hey! Hi. Welcome! Thank you! Come on in! Oh. Fuck! Hi! Uh, well, thanks for having us, man. I uh, appreciate it. This is Kyle Adair. Hi, I'm Kyle. Yep. And, uh, today we'll be interviewing you for our project. Um, do right. you want to do it here, or do you want to go up into your room? Uh, oh, no, th uh, this is my room. Uh, the garage? Mm-hmm. Is your... Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, it's... It's kind of hard to explain. Uh, I'll, I'll, like, tell you guys whenever we, like, we've set up and stuff, but... Okay, um, okay. Yeah, let's go. Wait, 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 wait. Um, uh, I apologize in advance for the kitty litter. It's, um, it's everywhere. So, sorry about that. No, oh, uh, what kind of cat do you have? I don't, I don't have a cat. Anyway, let's, um, let's go. Let's do it. Sayonara. Whisper sayonara. Bye. All right, Kyle. Um, 
first, first things first, why don't you uh, introduce yourself to the camera? Okay. <clears throat> Hi, my name is Kyle Adair. I am 22 years old. Uh, I live in, uh, um, okay, well, I, I mean, I, I'm not going to say exactly where I live, um, but it, it's like in the North America, like upper, like, I, I, I live in the U.S. Would you describe yourself as a sort of skeptical person, what some people might call, uh, let's say, uh, a conspiracy theorist? Uh, well, we don't really like the term, you know, conspiracy theorist, because it makes us sound like we're some, you know, basement dwelling, like, crackpots, basically. Uh, we prefer the term uh, conscious skeptics. So, uh, come over this way. Um, so, this is my workspace. I uh, got all sorts of gadgets and stuff that I've been doing here. So, um, like this one. Uh, so, this is a uh, groundwater monitoring sensor. Um, basically, what I can do with this is um, like detect any alien activity on the ground. Uh, so, that one's super cool. Um, uh, careful with that. Um, we also have like my radio wave sensors. Um, got some other stuff Ooh, in here. Ooh, what's this? Is this a, uh, an alien probe detector? Or something? <laughs> no, no. Um, that uh, that is actually from my mom's coffee press. Oh. Uh, uh, she doesn't know I have that though, so <laughs> please like like don't tell her I have that. Um, like, like really. If you don't mind me asking, why are you living in your garage? Your mom and dad still live here, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, they still live here. Uh, it, it's kind of embarrassing. I lost, um, house privileges. Uh, you know, they were just tired of, you know, the newspaper clippings on the floor, me erasing their iPhones with magnets, um, it, things like that. But, uh, the real reason I got kicked out was, um, it, it was like an incident involving this online series I have called Alien Mysteries. All right. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Um, in my last video, you might recall I asked what the best ways to uh, decontaminate your work gloves were. Uh, and a few of you said in the comments that electromagnetic waves might help. Uh, so I'm gonna throw it in the microwave for a few minutes. I put it in like a little bowl uh, and hopefully that'll help like guide the electro- That was weird. Um, hopefully it might help guide like the electromagnetic waves. Uh, in Okay, okay, whoa, 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 it's smoking, okay. Okay, oh my god, oh my god. Mom! Yeah. So I gotta ask, um, why aliens? When did, uh, Kyle Adair start believing in the extraterrestrial? Um, that's an interesting question. Um, you know, growing up, I was like mostly alone. I didn't really have a whole lot of friends, like except for you. Um, but mostly I was online, you know, reading, uh, you know, l looking at things like that. And I started going down this this uh, rabbit hole of uh, UAP, which is um, unknown aerial phenomenon, also known as UFOs. Basically, I started like looking into it, uh, and there's like actually a lot of evidence like pointing to it like being real, like. Uh, the hundreds of eyewitness reports, you know, official government released videos, like, you know, the more I got into it online, uh, you know, I eventually discovered this, like, whole community of people who believed in the extraterrestrial and, and, and aliens, and uh, they, it was, they are just like me, it was, yeah. Uh, what are these, uh, these red circles on this map? Oh, um, so... Uh, those are what I like to call uh, contact spots. Um, so like there and there, those are where I've seen like a lot of like extraterrestrial activity, like UFO sightings, things con like that. Uh, con contact spots. Yeah, yeah, like 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 I've seen like or like reports, I've, you know, things like that. Like I've seen a lot of activity there, basically. Yeah. Contact spots. What? Nothing. Man. Um. Do I ever get lonely? No, no. I mean, like, I, my st my parents are still here, so I I'll like see them from time to time. But 
Um, but they don't really understand, like, you know, what I'm doing here. Uh, I mean, COVID was pretty hard. Uh, I tried to sink myself into my work, like, distract myself. Um, and, and I mean, like, the online communities, they're great, but, um, they're just names on a screen. Yeah, I, 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 I guess I do get lonely sometimes. Oh, do I even want to know what this does? Uh, well, that act, that's actually just like a kid's game. Like, so basically you push the button in the middle and everyone grabs a hold of these things and pushes the button and it electrocutes somebody. Oh, shit. Well, but yeah, you have to turn it on, but um, yeah, it's like, it's kind of like a roulette game sort of thing. Like think Russian roulette, but with electricity. I, I was, I was planning on retrofitting it into a pH sensor, but I just haven't really gotten around to it. Who, who, who actively wants to get electrocuted? <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's fucking stupid. <laughs> hey, uh, Kyle? Hmm? What's this file called Alien footage final dot movie. Oh, um, that was just, that was just like one of those encounters I had. It, it was in the mountains at, at like one of the contact spots, you know? Yeah, yeah, it was just, it was a, a UFO that I saw. What, one of the contact spots in the mountains? Yeah, yeah, it, I mean, it was in the mountains, but like it, it was too dark, it was blurry, couldn't really like see anything really, you know? This is footage of contact in the mountains. Uh, I am currently in the Sandia Mountains with my wind-up flashlight out here. Uh, I am responding to an alert that I got on my atmospheric, uh, like, sensors telling me something entered the upper atmosphere. So I'm just out here taking a look around up in the sky, seeing if I see any lights. Uh, I don't currently see Hey, uh, Kyle. This is like that, that, that's, that's like a joke, right? Like, right? Like, is that for, is that for like a website or something? The video? Yeah. Is this like is this like a parody or something? No, no. That was that was one of the videos that I got at one of the contact spots I was telling you about. Look, watch. I have other things. Wait, you wait. No, 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 no. But like, you edited that, right? No. No, that was at one of the contact spots. Look, look at this one. That was another sighting I had at one of the contact spots. Wait, it, no, wait, wait, this is, wait, you, yeah. Yeah, that, so I have like these cameras set up out there, like in a bunch of different spots, and that was one of the contact spots I was talking about. Okay, we'll turn the cameras off, like, are you, are you, are you like fucking with us, like, right, actually? No. Like, like, for real, like, we won't record, like, no, is, this, is this real, like, are you fucking with us? No, I'm serious, that was the con- like, those were the contact spots I was telling you about, like... Like, like you know, like, you know that's not funny, right? Like, like, you know I get about this kind of stuff, like, it's not, like, right? like, actually, are you... Yeah, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm serious, like... What are you, what are you, what are you looking at? Do I think the government is lying to us? Yeah, yeah, uh, obviously. I, I mean, okay. I wouldn't call it lying so much as like poorly attempting to shelter. I, I mean, uh, the mystery of the Lubbock Lights of 54, I mean, I could, I could go on and on. The government has been actively trying to silence uh, conscious skeptics like myself for years now. Yeah. It, it, what do you mean by silence? Si silence as in I've received you know, multiple cease and desist orders from the Department of Defense. Uh, there's been vans just parked outside my house for weeks at a time, following us, watching us. And, and when I finally tried to put my foot down to them, 
and post some of the footage I got, suddenly my mom loses her job that she's had for 20 years. So why have you tried telling people any of this? <laughs> Look at me, man. Look where I'm living. Who's gonna believe me? <laughs> really? <laughs> um, Kyle, would you say that you're happy doing this? Am I happy? Uh, that's kind of a sudden question. I mean, you guys already asked if I'm lonely. You're trying to get out of here. Um, uh, no, no. Well, I mean, I, I, I don't know. I mean, what does it mean, like, to be, like, happy, right? <laughs> These past few years, it's, I've had a lot of ups and downs, and I, I, I think it's hard dedicating my life to something like this only to be treated like I'm insane or to be silenced by my own government. But, I, I mean, I have good days too, you know, like today. Today was really fun, you know? I, I don't really get to hang out with people that often. And I, I know we haven't talked in a while, but I mean, I, I think that goes to show how good of friends we are. You know, I mean, we haven't talked in years, yet we can just meet up and, and hang out and have a good time. Uh, so, yeah, I, <laughs> thank you. I, I really needed this. Fire and arrow.